things you have to do, man. Five minutes. Is the beer cool? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hell, yeah. It's pretty good. Pleasure to meet you, Justin. Nice to meet you, man. Hey, look at that. <laughs> and this is a no holds barred radio yeah, station, so I you can say yeah, whatever you want. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, what's your experience been like so far? How's Aftershock been? Oh, it's been great. I came here yesterday, so I got to experience the full day before we actually got to play. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Uh, but it's been great, man. I mean, great people. The fans have been great. The show was awesome. Uh, I'm just really excited to see Tool. Hell you know, yeah. Like, that's like part of the reason why I'm here. Yeah, like, Tool is all, awesome. Whatever people want to take away from our set, I just get to see a free Tool show. Hell yeah. So, <laughs> that's pretty good to me, you know? <laughs> Well, you guys put on what held the set, man. We did get to get out there. Yeah, we did get to get out there and see you. That was awesome. You guys did great. You guys got a lot of energy. A lot. Uh, that vocal range, bro. Uh, <laughs> you definitely got a set of pipes, man. Thank you, man. One of the more entertaining front men that I've seen in a long time. So, yeah, you really are. You get By far, dude. Dial it back, but that's pretty cool, man. I'm glad you Don't dial it back. Get it all out. Today, the sun was beating down on us. Did you guys come from Toronto? Did you guys come from Toronto? Well, actually, I'm the only one from Toronto in the band. The rest of you is from New York City. I actually drove from Spokane, Washington, all the way up here. Uh, I was doing a radio tour on my way here. So I hit a couple cities and I ended up here. And then um, on Tuesday, I head back to Toronto. I got to go to Fresno tomorrow. Awesome. So what's next? What's um, next for Broken Love? We have a couple one-off shows in the next two, three months uh, before the New Year. Uh, we're playing with Holly Suspect. I'll come out in November. I'm not sure exactly what the date is. We have a show with Corey DiCaprio. We're playing with the Glorious Sons in December. And then we're releasing our record in February on Valentine's Day. Oh, dude. Awesome. Yeah, the record will be outside. New record, new music, hell yeah. Man, <laughs> I think we're going to have a new single out uh, sometime around... What a more romantic gift to get your loved one. A new broken love. Right? right? That's what right? I'm saying. I mean, I think that's yeah. absolute that's poetry. That's a perfect gift. Yeah. Yeah. It's amazing. I feel like rock music. If they don't, then it's terrible. Definitely rock music. Terrible. Well, yeah. 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 Anything could happen. Yeah. So what's been your most exciting part about being at the festival so far? Um, yesterday, I got to see Rob Zombie play. And John Five is like one of my favorite guitar players. And just seeing him like, in the light, like that close to me. Dude, that guy is like, a beast on guitar. A beast, man. Absolutely, <laughs> man. And you, you very rarely see guitar players these days not play with a ton of effects. He just like plugs straight into the amp or whatever he's using. But there's no delay, there's no reverb. Oh, wow. It's like when he shreds, he did like a whole 10 minute solo last night on his own. Sweet picking and tapping and all this stuff. No delay. That is very impressive to see. Any guitar player. He had no delay? You know, no delay. Like clean. Whoa. So clean. And, and just do it on the fly like that in front of that many people. I mean, I've been such a fan for so long. To see that. <laughs> So what do you think about his solo stuff that he's getting ready to go out and do? It's amazing. It's amazing. He's playing amazing. back home and I really like to see it. What I love is guitar virtuosity, right? And you don't see a lot of that these days. That, that, I mean, there is a ton of great guitar players that are getting recognition, but not so many that are like mainstream, per se, like he is. And, and to have somebody like him uh, at the forefront of like, what guitar playing, uh, where guitar playing is going, you know, is amazing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, because people don't play like that. It's like, it's no, really no. unique. He has like, no, it's, it's like all synthesized yeah. effects. Yeah. Blues licks. I just do Jimmy Page on steroids. Like, that's, that's all I know how to do because I'm not trained. But somebody like that is really breaking the barriers. You know? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, man. Well, thank you very much for joining us here. Thank you so much. And we really do appreciate it. You guys have the best of luck. Keep us in mind. Yeah, for sure. Right. No, awesome thank set, bro. Thank you.